Percy was pulling the mail train one evening. It was very dark out and Percy could hardly see. He was going very slowly and trying to take care. But then he heard Gordon's whistle in the distance. Percy rushed right off the rails and right into the buffers. Next day, Edward, Rocky, and Harvey arrived to Percy's rescue. Percy would be in the works for a while. Sir Tottenham Hatt was deciding what to do about Percy. I don't know, Steen Thomas. Oh, I know, said Rosa. There's this engine on our old railway. Her name is Kaylee, continued Anaya. That is a splendid idea, said the fat controller. Smart thinking, Rosa and Anaya. The other engines were very pleased, and they were excited for the new engine's arrival. Next day, the new engine arrived. Here is Kaylee, said Rosa. And she will be pulling the mail train until Percy returns, said the fat controller. Kaylee was very excited. She had never pulled the mail train before, and she coupled up that evening, and she puffed happily away. She sang to herself as she pulled the mail train down the branch line. And she puffed down the Homestead Hollow branch line. Ah, there! And she raced right off the track. <laughs> Ouch! Parcels and sacks flew everywhere. Next day, Mia and Edward arrived to Kaylee's rescue. Are you all right? said Edward. I think so, Kaylee replied. We had better hurry, said Mia. A crowd is beginning to pile up. She said as Whiff pulled in. You are right, so the machines worked as fast as they could. Hmm. Kaylee puffed into the yard that afternoon. What's wrong? asked Rosa. They were puzzled. Where have you been? said Gabby. I was spooked by a bear and I came off the rails. Edward and Mia came to my rescue. Are you all right? Are you still going to pull the mail? No. I'm fine, but I won't ever pull the mail ever ever again, said Kaylee. It's too much. But you have to, for Percy. No, I don't, said Kaylee. I'll do what I want to. I'll stay away from the mail. But Kaylee, come back, whistled Mia. For the rest of the day, he puffed down the branch line, pulling coaches. The other engines became very worried, and they told the fat controller about it. Hmm, I'll think of a plan, he said. Kaylee returned to the yard. Dominic will pull the mail train, but he is ill. You will have to do it for him, said the fat controller, until he is better. Humph! Kaylee was cross, but she wanted to be useful, so she did her work without fuss. She pulled the mail train down the line that evening. Kaylee never looked, and she did the job just fine. <laughs> Kaylee returned that m the next morning, overjoyed with confidence, and she knew that her fears couldn't hurt her if her confidence took over. And Kaylee happily joined the Homestead Hollow Engines on the branch line when Percy returned home. Hmm. <laughs>